between Jeremy and Janelle. This 10 pounds of mainly fur, Momo, smiling, even with that dreadful doggy cone on. She's their joy. Her personality starting to come back after everything she went through. And this little trooper has been through a lot. A fractured liver broke her left foreleg. She needed to get a plate with some screws. It all started here last Saturday, a hike at the Royal Arch in Boulder. Sometimes we put her on a leash, sometimes we don't, and the hike was not too bad, um, not really too steep or anything until the very end. They made it to the arch, Momo right by her dad's side until suddenly she wasn't. There's kind of a surprise drop off that you can't see because of two large boulders under the arch and she just happened to go between the two boulders. I was trying to hold it together, but I just... I really just thought that she was, there was no way she could possibly survive that. I mean, it's just straight down, 150 feet. You know, you could hear and you heard a loud thump. And Nearby hikers called the sheriff's office, who connected Jeremy with the Rocky Mountain Rescue Group, an all volunteer professional rescue that doesn't charge to save people and pets. They were able to get her, but it took about three hours. By the end of it, she was like hypothermic. A miracle for a very grateful dog owner. I just broke out in tears because I was just like, bringing her dog home. The group says Jeremy made the right call in this case, not trying to go save Momo himself. Now the dog owner wants others to learn what he and Momo have in this near-death experience. There's a cliff out there and you won't see it till you see it. So glad Momo's okay. Now with Boulder's voice and sight control program, some dogs can be off leash at designated trails, but their owner has to go through a, a yearly course, a free one, and there are some other requirements. We have that information on this story on our website. We also have a GoFundMe for Momo. Nicole Fierro, Fox 31.